Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to take a deep dive into the business model of 8080 and uncover how they make money. If you've ever wondered about the strategy behind their car giveaways and product sales, you're in the right place. Let's get started. Before we dissect their business model, let's quickly go over what 8080 is all about. 8080 is an automotive apparel and accessories online retailer based in Utah, United States. They are known for selling car shirts, hats, and more, as well as hosting car giveaways that often feature supercars and substantial cash prizes. 8080 generates revenue through two primary streams, the sale of automotive clothing and accessories and the hosting of high-profile car giveaways. The company sells a variety of products such as car shirts, hats, and other accessories, which form a significant part of their income. Additionally, they use these sales to promote their car giveaways, which further boosts their product sales. One of the key aspects of 8080's business model is their car giveaways. These giveaways are a major draw for their audience and are often centered around high-value prizes like supercars and substantial cash amounts. To enter the giveaways, participants can visit the 8080 website and make purchases. For every dollar spent, they receive automatic entries into the giveaway, and at times, 8080 offers entry multipliers to further incentivize purchases. 8080 invests heavily in marketing, particularly through social media and influencer partnerships. They work with YouTube influencers and other social media personalities, especially those with a focus on cars, to promote their products and giveaways. This strategy helps them reach a wider audience and attract more participants to their giveaways. So there you have it. 8080's business model is built on a combination of product sales, high-profile giveaways, and strategic marketing. By leveraging the popularity of car culture and the power of social media, they have carved out a unique space in the automotive retail industry. We hope you found this breakdown insightful. If you did, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe for more content. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.